for visiting with Deb Bangelo, LPGA Master Professional. And Deb, tell me where it is that you do most of your coaching and corporate events these days. Yeah, well, that's, thank you for saying that. I'm based at Riverbend Country Club, which is here in Sugarland, and it's a wonderful facility. I'm able to do not only my private lessons, but I'm able to do a lot of group instruction, some quality corporate programming, and it's been a very, very nice place to locate to. I know it's important to the female executives mm-hmm. to learn to play golf. They, they want to move up the ladder. They want to fit in. Yep. Uh, how much work do you do with female executives, and do you have any examples of You know, quite a bit, first of all, because I think they come to me knowing that I could get them in a short amount of time ready to play in that environment, and then hopefully they continue on and really develop into players. But I have a great story about a woman that was very, it was very important to her to learn to play pretty quickly because she was going to get to go on the private jet to Dubai and play golf with all men. She was very important to her to learn not only about the skills that would help her in that environment for that first tournament, It was very important to her to know about how to dress, how to act, what was the etiquette, what are some basic rules. I gave her all of that before she came out to see me at Riverbend. When she came out to see me, she looked like a million bucks. I mean, she had nicer shoes than I've ever owned in my life. I think they're $1,000 a pair. And she said, you know what? No matter what happens, trust me, I'm going to continue onward with you. But no matter what happens, Deb, I want to look like a good player having a bad day. She got it. She figured it out, and to this day, shes I think she's about a 15 handicap, which is very solid, given her workload. I'm going to copy that, looking like a good golfer having a bad day. I think <laughs> you and high heels are a natural. <laughs> uh, yes, okay. Spikes of a different kind. One of the strengths uh, of golf for, I think, corporate entertainment is you can play it. Uh, basically, anyone can, can play it, enjoy it, unlike getting together for you know, a rough game of tennis or touch football or right. uh, talk about that a little bit about how it, no matter who you are, where you are, you can go play golf. Yeah. I mean, most of the scrambles that you even played in, mm-hmm. the, the idea is that you have a balanced team, a brand new golfer, maybe that has never been on the golf course with a very experienced golfer. And that hopefully levels the field. It's a scramble event many times in these environments. Mm-hmm. So it allows the player who is just initially learning to at least go out, have an enjoyable day. If they don't hit a good shot, big deal. Someone mm-hmm. on their team who has more experience will, and they still get to take part. And as one of the great golf writers once said, I apologize before we ever go out there by saying, no matter what it looks like, I am trying. So you, you, you don't know really have to care. And, and if, if your group makes that person feel comfortable, they're going to mm-hmm. stay in the game. And guess what? They may be leading your team the next time you play in that very event. But if they have a terrible experience because of inappropriate pressure or just uncomfortableness overall, and this is men and women, they may never come back again. Well, and the handicap system makes it a lot fairer. Great equalizer, isn't it? Mm-hmm. I mean, you know, it means that the low handicap player can play with a brand new beginner. And if that beginner has a very, very nice day because some of their skills started showing up that day, they have a chance of really scoring nicely. We have, in the few minutes we have left, how can people get in touch with you? Oh, well, thank you so much for that. You know, I am on the web just because I do everything online, technology-wise. Mm-hmm. Uh, my website is my name, debvangelogolf.com, and certainly by calling Riverbend, which they'll direct you probably to the website because that's where my scheduler is. Okay. My teach days are Wednesday through Sunday out there, unless I'm out of town on LPGA business, and mm-hmm. everything's great. I have a closing question because I've heard it since I started the game. You can tell a lot about a person by the way they play golf. Can you talk to that a little bit? Yeah, I think how how you manage yourself after you hit a shot that you did not like, how well you manage yourself after a shot you did like. Deb, real quick again, if you would give out your website. Okay, my website is www.debvangelogolf.com. And spell Vangelo. V as in Victor, A-N-G-E-L-L-O-W. Thanks so much. Thank you for having me. And folks, stay tuned next week on the Jobs Pipeline radio program. Our guest will be Universal Weather and Aviation, and we'll be talking about private and corporate jet airplanes. That's next week on the Jobs Pipeline radio program. Visit the Jobs Pipeline Facebook page at facebook.com backslash jobs pipeline. Send your questions, comments, or recommend a guest by sending an email to info at mittenmedia.com. Jobs Pipeline is written and produced by Mitten Media and the Radio Lounge. Join us again next week at 6.05 p.m. for Jobs Pipeline, Brought to you by Genesis Oil & Gas with a deeper understanding.